let's have the different, divided difference method. The divided difference method is an effective method no, for constructing the interpolating polynomial for a given set of data and then finding the intermediate value not found in the data. So may, we may have the following steps. Assume the function f of x to be known no, at several, several values of x. And then use the following general formulas for the first divided difference between two values of x, let's say x sub s and x sub t. So, as you can see, we have here the difference between x sub s and x sub t. So, first we have the difference between the y values over uh, the difference between the x values. So, f, f sub t and f sub s respectively are the corresponding values for x sub s and x sub t. And then for a higher order difference, you have x sub o up to x sub n. So you have uh, f applied at x sub 1 up to x sub n minus here you have x sub o and then only up to x sub n minus 1 divided by x sub n minus x sub o. See, so this is the nth order difference and the initial value uh, of y no, under that order difference. And then for the zero order difference, so we have uh, f of x sub s is just equal to f sub s. So this is the first value of y okay, at the zero order difference. So this is actually given. The interpolating polynomial that would fit a divided difference uh, table at uh, the values x sub o up to x sub n will be as follows. So we, if we have n uh, n number of points, uh, then the, well, let's say we have uh, n, plus, uh, n plus one point, so uh, let's say we have uh, five points, then the highest degree polynomial would be four, okay? So this is, so we only, as you can see in the formula, we only consider the initial values you know, at the zero order difference. So if this is uh, four, degree or we have five set uh, uh, data points then this should be uh, n orders of so fourth degree and then we have a fourth order up to the up we compute up to the fourth order difference and then as you can see we have uh, the prod uh, the dif the difference now between x and then the initial values the initial starting at, at the initial values of x then followed by one two and so on up to n minus one construct the difference divide the difference table for the values shown in the table obtain the interpolating polynomial of degree four that fits the table from x sub o t point two to x sub five 5.6 so we have here five data points so we expect a fourth degree or we want to find a fourth degree inter or we find the interpolating polynomial using the divided difference method okay so you're given uh, set of points okay so first column represents your x values and then your y values or f of x so we the y values will be treated as the the zero order and then followed by the first order different second order third order up to fourth order which is equal to um then the number of points minus minus one okay 
Okay, so let's start with, so the, the highlighted color here represents your initial values for each uh, order difference. Okay, so let's start here. So this will be considered as the initial value at zero order. And this is the initial value of y at the first order. So we just get the difference between, or the ratio between the di uh, differences between y and then x. So y first followed by x. Okay, so y minus x over the difference between x. Maybe we can move the pressure down more. Let us check if we are selecting the correct. Okay, so we can just move the pressure down more. Okay, and then here we have, uh, we add uh, one skip okay, between x. Okay, you know, skip between y. Okay, but for x, we skip 2.7. Okay, and then we can move the cursor downward. Okay. And then, here we have difference between y with no skip. And then here, Add another skip, so it's now two, two skip, or two cells. And then we move the cursor downward. And then this is the last order. So difference between y over, okay, so we now have three cells. So we will just consider the initial values okay. at each order difference for our interpolated polynomials. Okay. So these are f, f sub o at zero order, f sub o at first order, and so on. And then we just substitute here, so start with 22 plus 8.4 times x minus 3.2, this one. The initial value is at 3.2. So 2.856, this one. And then this is now second degree, so x minus 3.2 times x minus 2.7. And then negative uh, 0.527 times, so we have third degree here. So x minus 3.2 times x minus 2.7 times x minus 1. And then the last degree, so we expect a fourth degree interpolating polynomial. So 0.256 and then x minus 3.2 times x minus 2.7 times x minus 1, times x minus 4.8, okay? And then we can use this to find a value, or to find the value of y not in the table, no, not in this table. So 2.5 is not in the table, so we can um, compute for y. Okay, you can input the formula here, okay? So select the value and... Um, uh, values of initial values at uh, every uh, order difference and then the value of x okay which is 2.5 okay in this interpolated formula and then that is 16.2 28.54 okay 